We have with us Lloyd Schofield. How are you, sir? Uh, hi, Mr. Levin. Thanks for inviting me on your show. Yes, sir. What is what, uh, Honestly, in this article, I can't tell. What's the name of your group? Um, the name of our, well, our bill uh, is called... No, no, no. What's the name of your group? What's the name of your group? The group? The it's committee. The committee formed to pass the initiative. So, so it has no name, really? Well, uh, our committee is called, uh, we're a committee opposing forced male circumcision. All right, listen to me. This is not a hard question. Do you have a name for your committee or no? Yes or I no? I just told you. It's the What's committee it opposed to forced male circumcision. That's the name I of it? I didn't get it the first time. No, I, I'm very slow that's on our, these That's things. our committee for the initiative. Is, is that your question? All right, let's move on here. What got okay. you involved in this on this subject? Um, well, I always knew it was a very wrong thing to do, and um, I, the past few years I've been studying uh, the issue, talking to people. I went to attended an international symposium that was held at UC Berkeley on the subject, and um, people have been studying this is issue for decades, and I've kind of learned from them. What do you do and, for a living? Uh, I'm sorry? What do you do for a living? I'm really not here to talk about me or what I do for a living. Or Why? Uh, people are curious about what would draw somebody well, to I'm such sure a are. Maybe I'll write a book about it someday. And no, I don't, don't want to read a book, pal. Hey, thing. look, if you're going to be an ass, I'm going to circumcise you right now. Well, I, I asked you a question, and none of these questions have been provocative. But you're I pissing told, me off. I, I so let me, be, I, let me be, I don't care what you said. You into this subject. Pardon me? I, I'm telling you. I know you uh, told me I, you went to a symposium. Well, great. I go to symposiums. That doesn't mean uh, I go to a symposium on Turkish history. It doesn't mean I'm pushing bans on or favor Turkish history. I'm asking you, why well, did this Mr. issue in Levin, particular you're draw very your attention? Successful with what you do, but you're really uh, not a very good listener, are you? You know what? I'll so far, again. so I've far, you said, so far, lower him. So far, you've turned a very simple issue into something very complicated. Now, let me explain something to you. Bring him back. To other people. Let me explain something to you. You're a nut. Uh, well, you're You should go to symposiums for nuts. Ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. And I, I, I'd like to know what you do, but you must be a coward. You must be scared to tell people what you do. Well, it's really... I'm not here to talk about that. But I'm here to ask you about it, pal, because I want to know about you. But you don't want to tell us. That tells me you do things you're not proud of. What do you do? It's none of your business, Mr. Levin. It's all of my business. You're pushing something. You want a nat you want a uh, a vote on it. You want to put it on the ballot. I want to know who you are. Who are you? The initiative. And if you would look at the initiative and read, it, and I read research, your filthy your filthy initiative, and I asked you a question. Who are you, and what do you do? Personally, but right, I guess you know that's what? what you know what? I've had enough. Reader. Get rid of this guy. I can't take it. I didn't start this interview looking to yell at a guy. As a matter of fact, most of my guests... Do I yell at most of my guests, Mr. Producer? This is probably the first one, maybe the second one in all these years. What are you doing? What's the name of your group? Why are you motivated by that? I went to a symposium. Well, but what motivated you? You must not be listening. Yes, I wanted to know more for reasons I can't really say right now because I couldn't get more information. This is a health issue. It's also a religious issue for most Jews. That's why I wanted to know about his background and know a little bit more about him. Why well, he wouldn't tell us. And the members of the committee, we're not allowed to know who they are either. We don't know who's behind this or what's behind it. All we know is that for this guy, his single issue is circumcision. Sounded a little creepy, didn't he? A little dirty. Just my opinion. Because I don't listen well. The Committee for the Circumcision Initiative. Or as we like to call it, the CCI. And I went to a seminar. International seminar at UC Berkeley. 
Oh, that must have been a thrill. I bet you were scribbling all your notes down. I bet, I bet you were slobbering all over your notepad. Hey, pal, I wanted to talk to you in a uh, very honest and forthright way, but there's something wrong. I'm not here to talk about me. Well, I was here to find out who you are. If you're advocating a position, if you're holding yourself out in public, if I may say, then of course I want to know who you are and what motivates you. Maybe you just told us. You're very, very secretive. Well, that was a complete flop. Let's move on, shall we? Tell me, Daddy, what do you do for a living? I run the Committee uh, for uh, Penal Integrity. (laughs) Sorry, I'm cracking myself up.